95 years ago, my grandfather invented the stopwatch which measures one hundredth of a second. That was a major breakthrough in the technology world of those years. He called it the micrograph. As you can see here, he wrote it with a K and not with a C because it was basically, he said it was more German oriented than, um, than English or French. And the unit beat at the time at 360 beats per hour. 25 years later, we have put this unit here into a wrist and I'm very happy because we still use the name Micrograph, we use the logo, and one must, be, must remember that this watch here made the brand famous in the world because it was a major breakthrough. Until then, you could only measure a fifth of a second, so the entire universities, research institutes, physics, chemistry, military, immediately realized the importance of the, of the invention and we produced it for 20 years alone because we had heavily patented it and another 40 years until finally electronics took over where you read off the hundredth of a second much easier. Yeah. Uh, since we just had our 150 year anniversary I very carefully analyzed all the inventions we made in those periods and I must say this was the major breakthrough. It was so strong that my grandfather could impose that the brand was on the dial. Normally the import is in, in those beginning of the last century. Uh, the watch importer you'd uh, put his name on. Uh, and he was able to impose that on the dial, yes. So it really made us quite overnight quite famous and it probably also had a consequence that, that we were asked to supply the official watches for the Olympic Games 1920, 1920. 20, 24 and 28. Right?